Hello everyone. Welcome back to CD University. I'm your host Abid Rahman. Today we have two energetic and wonderful guests with us. First of all, I would like to request our guests to please introduce themselves to our audience. Hi, myself Dr. Nurizama, uh, head of department for <coughs> optometry at Shankara Eye Hospital. Uh, hello, I'm uh, Aditya Goyal. I'm the principal of Shankara College of Optometry, which is a part of Shankara Academy of Vision. Thank you so much, sir, for uh, giving us your precious time. My, I will just start this session. Is uh, first of all, how do you feel coming to CD University, and what's your experience, you know, with CD University, and how do you feel whenever you come to our camps? It's like you can can you explain to our audience, please? Yeah, it feels great. See, the university has a huge campus, uh, full of life. The faculty staff, to whom. Uh, we interact and we get the feedbacks. They are excellent in their work, and the feedback of these students are tremendous. So we are part of the City University, and we I thoroughly enjoy every minute at the campus. Yes, being in, being at City University. Correct. Yes, sir. Uh, like uh, Sankara uh, Eye Foundation, if I talk about uh, the one of the leading uh, in the field of optometry. So I just want to know that uh, what 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 are you actually providing to youth and providing to students who really want to join the optometry? Okay, so <clears throat> with City University, Shankara Academy of Vision, we have all the gamut of courses that we have in optometry. So we have uh, the bachelor's program, we have the master's program, we have lateral entry, which is from diploma to degree, and uh, we are the only people in the country who also have PhD in optometry. Okay. So it is the entire scope of optometry education that we are doing with CT University and Shankara. And uh, this is uh, the only one of its kind in the country. Yes. And uh, I think we have a very good uh, relationship with uh, the management of CT University. They have been very, very supportive in everything. And we don't actually feel that we are going to a university. It's like our another campus for us. Yes, it's like in home, like environment. It's a it's a home environment. Yes, yes. sir. Uh, one more question is there. As today's youth, basically most of the youth is going towards science or engineering, as we know. So how do you uh, just uh, tell our audience that uh, optometry is a field where you you have opportunity to come. A lot of jobs are there, especially okay. which you doesn't know actually. Okay. Uh, let me ask you a question. Sure, sir. Do we have a right to see? Yes, of course we have. If we have a right to see, today in India, population, even if I take a very conservative approach, it is 130 crores. Yes. 130 crore population, if every person hmm. has a right to see and he is examined once in a year, yes. we require, if every optometrist is working 365 days, and examining 20 patients a day, 20 uh, Indians a day, okay. we require 1,75,000 optometrists okay. as so of today. A lot of opportunities. Yes. yes, and what we have right now is about 25 to 30,000 optometrists. Okay. So all we across the country. All across the country. Okay. So what we require the today, yes. we require minimum minimum one and a half lakh optometrists more. Okay. So that is the gap that we have. Okay, sir. Uh, as I uh, read about uh, about your uh, organization, there is uh, one more thing, Sankara uh, Academy of Vision. Uh, as I came across it, could you please uh, tell more about this academy? Like what kind of uh, things you are doing in this academy, okay. or are, are some programs that you are offering? Shankara Academy of Vision is a part of Shankara Eye Foundation. Okay. It's an academic wing. So in that we have uh, some programs like DNB, nursing, optometry. Uh, some sorts of fellow, fellowships, okay. certificate courses. So optometry, the Shankara College of Optometry is a part of Shankara Academy of Vision and we are thoroughly dedicated towards the eye care, uh, providing the training, support, uh, teaching. We have all the infrastructures, equipments, uh, world class, uh, I mean, I mean setup where the ophthalmologists, optometrists, the, all the eye care practitioners can come, practice, learn and they can uh, do wonders and provide the service to the community. 
सर वॉट इज द रोल ऑफ योर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन स्पेशली वैन यू आर कोलोब्रेटिंग विद सी टी यूनिवर्सिटी सो इट मीन्स दैट नाउ टू फैमिलीज और यू नो दे आर गेटिंग ज्वाइन एंड इज इट लाइक अ कॉम्बिनेशन इन इज देयर सो हाउ डू यू फील दिस कोलेब्रेशन दैट यू हैव डन विद सी टी यूनिवर्सिटी एंड वट यू एक्चुअली आर प्रोवाइडिंग टू द स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ सी टी ओके सो लाइक वॉट डॉक्टर नू वॉज मैंशनिंग वी हैव ट्वेल्व हॉस्पिटल्स अक्रॉस इंडिया एंड ऑल आर आई हॉस्पिटल्स Uh, super speciality eye hospitals and we deal in all the specialties sub speciality super specialties of eye care okay so all our students have access to everything so they are mentored by the best in eye care okay they have like what he mentioned we have all the infrastructure which in- comprises of uh, libraries and uh, equipment and most importantly patients okay and uh, just to tell you a little bit about our organization we are community eye care based organization okay. our main dna if i may use the word yes. is community eye care okay. so 80% of our patients are treated absolutely free of cost oh, that's wonderful i mean uh, uh, there <clears throat> comes some rural areas where i see the people yes. are not able to just to go on yes. to the hospitals and you are doing free free of cost absolutely free okay. so 20% of our paying patients they uh, take care of the 80% yes non paying patients and we have our vans we have our uh, uh, people optometrists ophthalmologists we go to the villages evaluate them get them to the hospital operate them treat them and then take them back to the villages so all our students have access to excellent i care facilities as well as opportunities yes it's wonderful to hear sir actually that the point that you mentioned that you are treating 80% of the patients at free of cost it's really wonderful and uh, sir uh, how are you looking coming again to ct university and what's what really you feel inside your heart whenever you come to ct university and any message that you want to give the students like you said earlier it is like a house okay so it is not coming to city university we are we coming are a part of home. we are we are part of city university and okay. city university is a part so uh, i have been uh, dealing with other universities in the past also okay but the kind of apna pan that we have over here we i have never experienced in other places oh, wow Yeah, every guest that comes here mentions this point sir you want to give any message or any point that you want to share with other students yeah uh, no message but uh, i would share my uh, gratitude to the university yes. they are uh, doing good uh, they the students are happy to be here to be part of the city university yes. we do teach and we do interact with the students uh, those who go from here to uh to the industry yeah. and they are thoroughly uh, happy and there are a lot of positive uh points and positive values to their life yes exactly uh, as we know that ct university has a, a legacy of 25 years uh, in the field of education so i think this interview would definitely benefit the students who want to join the field of optometry we will thank our guests once again to giving uh, giving your precious time to us thank you so much for joining us in this interview we'll be looking forward to meet you in the next video with some other guests around us till then stay happy stay blessed and goodbye